How's it going guys? My name is Graham. I'm here with Paul, aka Super Positive. We're trying out the brand new game, Arcade Spirits. Feels very Valentine's season appropriate. It's it's like a dating sim, but it's supposed to be an alternate reality where video games are like the dominant form of media, I think. Everyone's lives just heavily revolve around video games. That's uh -huh. my understanding. I'm I don't know what to think. Besides, <laughs> it's a game that I just heard about, like, seven minutes ago. <laughs> <laughs> two minutes ago before we- two minutes before we decided to play it. Exactly. I think the start of it is we get to make our characters. So the start of it's gonna be, uh, like a nice easing into the experience. Yeah. Oh, hey, you wanna be the computer? Sure. Database system online. New profile detected. Analyzing? Analyzing, analyzing, new profile, economic bracket, lower middle, employment category, bleak, current emotional health, rating, low. I was hoping it would be positive, Oh no, but... my emotional health! <laughs> we'll get it back up there, buddy. We'll be positive in no time. Super positive. Guarantee it. <laughs> Ideal candidate for premium level assistance. Proceed? Nah, shut it down. <laughs> Negative! <laughs> well, what we could do? Premium level assistance re-requested. Proceed? <laughs> I'm a, there's not really options, right? It's just you're, you just yeah, get it's negative. Yeah, just going. It's Pretty just please. going. <laughs> Negative! This computer's a jerk. Overriding <laughs> denial of assistance. <laughs> Establishing premium services for profile. <laughs> I love the, whoever the pink text is, it's like trying to help me out. The white text is just like, no, we can't afford that. <laughs> like, We're just going to bash our way through. That's like too, that's too much. And the, the pink one's like, yeah, I don't need you anyways. We'll be fine. <laughs> Justification? Hope. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not hopeful. <laughs> Very little reason given so far to be hopeful. Hope should be rewarded. Spirit must be restored. Ooh, this is getting okay. uh, very existential for a dating sim. Now yeah. compiling personal metadata. Ooh. Oh. Do you just okay. get to randomize the name? Do we let the chat help pick the name? How do we, how do oh, we go about that? Oh my gosh. Guys, guys, what should we name our character? <laughs> let's let's wor work on physical appearance while the chat figures out a name. That That's fair. Uh, okay, so... Uh, what do you hair, think? Male, female, style? other, if available? Oh, they Let's... only have short, medium, and long. I see. I like medium. I'm Not a fan. Deepest. Yeah, it looks good. Nice, that kind of uh, stylish, messy. Oh, wow. They have a lot of, like, options for, like, skin tones. Right. That's I'm nice. pasty as all hell. So I always yeah, feel like same, I end so up I'm getting... Like, I'm probably going to go for, like... <laughs> like a brown ish, like a like a lighter brown, like that. Whenever I choose skin color in games, I feel like I always go like a shade or two darker than my actual, and then I can live out that fantasy of what it's like to not be a ghost boy. <laughs> Basically. And in terms of like who I wanna be, I think just Oh wow, interesting. He, she, they. That's that's actually that's pretty good. cool. Good to be but, inclusive. Yeah, that's progressive. And yeah, no. Uh, let's see. Hair uh, my calling. favorite recommendation for a name so far is Cool Kid 82. <laughs> Don't give <laughs> ourselves a real name, just give ourselves like an AOL alias. Oh my god. <laughs> what hair color should she be? How how punk rock? Do we wanna be do we wanna be crazy wild flare hair color? We can be Ooh. like a like a bright purple. My vote is yellow, simply because I've been really into Tessa Violet's music lately, and she has a really dope looking yellow haircut. Like this? Like this shade, or...? No, like fake yellow, like like that kind of yellow. This one? Like the a bright, bright and vibrant as can be. It's weird, it's such a fake, fake looking color, but she looks super cool. I'm going to Everyone assume that one's fine. Yeah, yeah. Everyone should listen to Tessa Violet. Eye color, and obviously for eye color, we should be the most common eye color, which is a dark shade of purple. Or no, light shade <laughs> of purple. <laughs> of course. The most common. 
Oh, we don't even get to choose our outfit. It's just just the it's color. It's just the clothing color, yeah. I'm going to leave that all on you since I, I pushed for the hair. All right, so I think I'm going to go just as plain white <laughs> <laughs> as possible. All right, did we decide on a name? Uh, there's a few things. We got Chad Moosey, Cool Kid, Alex, Bean, Rockstar, like XX Cool Kid XX. <laughs> I like the idea of giving the screen name, I'll be honest. Yeah, like everyone else we're going to meet is going to be like Mike and Jeffrey and Ashley and we're going to be Cool Kid 82 or something. So this is cool. <laughs> and then okay, and then the last name will have the... The last name will be Kid. X X X is supposed to mean something, and I don't remember what it is. Does it actually mean anything? It well, it's just like a goofy like MySpace remnant or whatever. But I think it was supposed to mean something at one time. Uh, it probably doesn't anymore. Yeah, couldn't tell you. Lost all meaning. It's like <laughs> Latin. People are gonna yeah. look at that in a thousand years and have no idea what they're looking at. I love that. This is amazing. Just cool. <laughs> cool, kid. <laughs> For whatever I'll... reason, back in the year 2000 and some, people had a lot of silent X's all over. <laughs> there was knife with silent K's and then just X's everywhere. <laughs> yeah. All right. So XX cool kid XX. Is this <laughs> correct? <laughs> I'd yeah. say yeah. I'd say we nailed it. I think we. I think we got it. I'm happy with this result. <laughs> oh, we missed it, but there was a recommendation to name it My Butt like you would in Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, premium level assistance for profile XX Cool Kid XX has been activated. I'm going to never read the X's again. That was the one time. It's going to get too redund <laughs> redundant. For the sake of her hopes and dreams. That felt like an incomplete sentence. <laughs> All my hopes and dreams are dead. <laughs> I was really waiting for more of that sentence, but... All references to trademark, usual disclaimer, that's fine. Yeah. One time a game should just gamble and be like, No, all of this infringement was intentional. Winners don't use drugs! <laughs> Sorry, I just saw the reference to old arcade cabinets. Right, and that is pretty great. I fell in love. I never had a good arcade in my town. You never had an arcade? No, our town never had one. So like, oh, I just that's have such boo. <laughs> I know it's a it's a bummer, right? So upsetting. I obviously had the opportunity to play arcade games here and there, but not a lot. Wow, this is I love that it's an obscure t year that is XX. <laughs> well, that, I mean that's because they get like ninety nine tries, right, to guess the year. <laughs> We're going to fit right in, though. People are just going to think there's missing letters from our name. <laughs> just, you, you can just fill it in. You can call me whatever you like and just randomize those X's. <laughs> it is the future year, 20XX, a dark era in which mankind is pushed to the brink of catastrophe. It looks like Los Angeles. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds about right. <laughs> Woe be to the human race, plagued by evil, terrifying, utterly sinister. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Just waffling on that. Robots, maybe. Evil robots? How's that work? Yeah, no, sorry. The, year, the future year 20XX is pretty much what you'd expect it to be. No flying cars, smartphones, pro gamer celebs. No pro gamer celebs. Oh wait, no, there is pro gamer no, celebs. No, yeah, separated. We're, they're they're booming. Internet trolls, personal assistant AIs. That's dope. That's like I'm just imagining a tier above, like you know, Siri and Google Home and stuff. They're underselling <laughs> how cool it's that is. It's just Alexa. What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> Cheese flavored snack foods. But even with such wonders as 20XX holds. To date, I've had no part in any of them. Wait, so are we a computer? I don't think so. I've worked as a dishwasher. That would be, uh, like, you know, the computer would be a little overqualified. I think we're a regular human being. Overqualified <laughs> <Assume>. to date. Yes. <laughs> 
<laughs> a shoe salesperson and lifeguard for the local community pool. All right. I don't care what era of human history you live in. Kitties peeing in the pool is pretty much a constant thing. Trust me on this. I don't think it's limited to the kids. Mm -hmm. <laughs> As for the bustling metropolis of 24-hour neon utopia you see here, my little corner of it isn't nearly as shiny and cool. Let me show you. Behold, my quaint little apartment. I do like their little penguin thing, whatever they got going on there. Oh yeah, this, like, penguin <laughs> bat. <laughs> A completely undecorated apartment, and then one little penguin statue. They're doing it right. Basically, like, the wall's falling apart. You yeah, get, like, a poster or two. Cover up your cracky-ass walls. <laughs> <laughs> okay it's paradise <laughs> you know, that's that's how you do it when you live in cheap <laughs> living areas i mean you're not wrong uh, it's paradise in a relative sense i only pay half the rent neighborhood stabbings have been down this year also my roommate picks up any stray socks or shirts i leave lying around that roommate deserves an award i would never touch my roommate's dirty laundry no i wouldn't either <laughs> In fact, as things go, I'm living large compared to most in my family tree. Or at least I was before today. Oh, there's, oh, there's actually, actually voice acting. acting in this. I was not prepared for that. <laughs> Neither was I. But she so has, maybe... like, the loudest voice, like, the scurliest thing that you could do. Just, you got fired from another job? <laughs> Just... Now I wish there wasn't voice acting. I wish you just took the reins on that. Wait, cause... can I can I actually change something? Can I turn off voice acting? Voice volume! You totally can. I wonder if we would get sick of doing voices awful quick, though. We'll find out. That's your call. I'll leave that in your hands. <laughs> Seriously? Seriously? XX cool! <laughs> <laughs> That's three jobs since we've left the suburbs. Just a big middle finger to the dev for paying for voice actors. <laughs> no, <laughs> we're going to do it. The horrified looking young woman there would be my roommate and childhood friend, Juniper. I love it. Juniper is the one who spearheaded this effort to co-rent an apartment. She's also the one who encourages me whenever I lose a job. Like, you know, today. I don't get why you aren't more upset about this. I'm upset. <laughs> I'm upset on your behalf. Come on, share the load a little, okay? <laughs> I, really, I really love that now, whatever the original, whatever you would call it, script directions were of, like, delivery is now thrown out the window and you like maybe this girl is just kind of like i don't know i'm pretty upset and now you've gone times 20 like i'm so upset <laughs> get to set whatever mood you want <laughs> oh man i mean yeah <laughs> that's just mm. the way that this world works <laughs> <laughs> moosey just pointed out her cool cat stockings those are pretty great <laughs> Yeah, she does have nice cat stockings. Am I going to be the the narrator cool. but not the character? Or should yeah, I, I be... Cool. Okay. Yeah. Pool's closed, Juniper. Not much I can do about that. Why get upset? Because you actually enjoyed that job. More than you enjoyed dishwashing soap and smelly socks at the very least. <laughs> <laughs> Usually one individual inanimate object isn't the uh, the appeal of a job. <laughs> I'm not Basically. the complaining sort. These things just happen. Things fall uh, apart. <laughs> Paused for a second. The center does not hold. That's a bit morbidly poetic, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, she does look upset. Her eyes are turning red. She's like biting her lips and stuff. This, I feel like that is the appropriate tone. You're you're matching the intent perfectly. I feel like I'm the better voice actor at the end of the, <laughs> the, end of the day. Step aside, original Juniper voice actor. <laughs> it's my turn. <laughs> they overpaid. They could have got Paul for a fraction. <laughs> no, I mean, the community center literally fell apart and the pool won't hold water anymore. Whatever, I'll just get another job. Any job will do as long as we can make the rent, right? 
Did you ever watch Run! Play the Concords? <laughs> Sorry, say that again. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't mean to undercut there. Did you ever watch Play of the Concords? I never have. Oh man, there's just like one little story arc where they're struggling to pay rent and so he starts like applying to be a male prostitute. It like obviously never gets that far, but like just the antics of them exploring that as an option are amazing. There's a whole song about you don't have to be a prostitute. <laughs> oh, God. I don't think this game's going to take a step that far. I think it'll reel in a few a few steps before it gets that extreme. <laughs> exactly. But uh, anyways, to, be, to channel my inner juniper again. Wrong! <laughs> <laughs> I saw how mopey and tired you were coming home every night from those other crappy jobs. I only have one energy level and it's way up here. <laughs> At least when you got back from the pool each day, I sometimes caught you smiling. <laughs> <laughs> Uh-huh. <laughs> oh, no, there's more. Damn. I feel like you're wearing yourself out. <laughs> I'll eventually tone it down, I promise. What's the point <laughs> of us moving away from home if it's not to get away from all, all of that? <laughs> <laughs> she is crumbling again. Now she's at an all-time low. She's more stressed out than ever, Polly. You're going to have to... Aim a little higher there. Louder, more distraught. <laughs> I'm gonna have to start taking off my headphones for all of Juniper's lives. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, I'll tone it down. I no, mean, it's... <laughs> we both left that town so we could try to find happiness, right? <sighs> I just want us to be happy, both of us. I thought you hated your job. No deflecting, this is about you. <laughs> <laughs> My mind's made up. We're gonna find you a job that's just as good, if not better, than the lifeguarding job. I liked the little, uh, video game sounding like alert for her getting an idea. Right? It sounds really nice. <laughs> Imagine having a really, really stupid idea and hearing an achievement noise. <laughs> Level up! <laughs> but, like, it would be when you thought it was a good idea. So people yeah, would just exactly. hear, like, the... Dee -dee 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 -dee, and then they'd be like, what was that? What's on your mind? And you'd be like, no, I immediately realized it's stupid. Please, no one make me say it out loud. <laughs> Basically. <laughs> Let's start from the top. What's your dream? What's your passion? <laughs> <Just> <laughs> Lay it on me, Juniper. You can squeeze out every drop of my fiber of my being. You really cut to the core. Well, I'm standing in front of class to give a speech, and I forgot to put on my pants. And wait, didn't you title this stream something about not putting pants on? <laughs> I, oh, that that's was for like, the other game. That's the go live notification. <laughs> oh, that's what it was. Well, it, it ended up fitting perfectly. It did. <laughs> Very predictive. Your dream job. <laughs> very pouty. I'm oh. very, very sassy right now as I do her voice. Oh yeah, you can see it all in the lips there. I don't know, Juni Juniper. I've never really given it any serious thought. It's pronounced Juniper. <laughs> Juniper. Not Juniper. <laughs> Juniper. I don't even know. Oh, hey. There's no voice actors. We get to decide. <laughs> I think I've got just the right thing to help you out. Don't worry. Free advice on me, boo-boo. <laughs> <laughs> Juniper pulls out her phone, rapidly tapping an unlock code onto the glass before pointing out a little pink icon. One, 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 one. It's a virtual life coach app. Mine keeps me from being late to meetings, totally free to. My cousin introduced it to me. Only the Russians know about it. <laughs> <laughs> We're getting into the underground app world. <laughs> the underground app. <laughs> <laughs> it's totally free, but if the mob ever needs a favor... <laughs> you have to go and you have to do what they ask. 
doesn't matter what they ask you for. You just mm. have to go. <laughs> <laughs> no is not an option. They own you. <laughs> That's probably... Uh, now that all these new, like, cookies, terms of services pop up on every website within the last, like, couple months, one or two of them is, is buying your soul. It's just <laughs> inevitable, right? Yeah. <laughs> You're signing away something. Wasn't he the guy who ended up in the ER after making a homemade flamethrower? That sounds like the mafia. <laughs> it would have worked if he got the fuel mixture and his water gun right. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds safe. <laughs> I, I think I like Juniper, I'll be honest. Yeah. She, she leads a, a very exciting life. <laughs> Anyway, I'm sending a copy to you now. I got a pop-up an hour ago offering me 500 points just for recommending it to a friend. Great timing, right? <laughs> oh, she's pyramid scheming us through an app. <laughs> well, as long as you're earning points, I guess. <laughs> 1,000 points and I get a coupon to Subway. <laughs> <laughs> or... I'm trying to think of something just like you get a discount towards the app. The free app is discounted in some way. That's how they trick you. You think you're earning something useful, but you're not. Oh my gosh. Subway would be an awesome bonus. I'd be down for that. At least give it a try, okay? Maybe it can point you at some good jobs. Ones with less socks and or urine. Oh, I hope and. <laughs> I'll, I'll think about it. Okay, okay, but don't think too long, right? I need you out of the apartment by seven. <laughs> <laughs> I have company coming over, and I can't... I have to clean up. Your clothes are everywhere. Just She looks around. She just sees everything. I also have to give someone this penguin. The only decoration <laughs> in our home. No, don't give it away. It ties the entire apartment together. <laughs> Also, I think uh, Cool Kid had said that Juniper picks up stray socks and clothes when we leave them lying around, so I intend to never clean up that mess. <laughs> oh, this is probably why the character creator was a little more limited, is that if they're going to have, like, cutaways where they actually draw... Yeah. I draw out the character, like, three hairstyles, it makes it a little more <laughs> reasonable. Given what we actually had as options, they allowed you to change quite a bit. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it is surprising now that I see that, like, it's not just going to look the exact same in every shot. That's cool. Uh, maybe we should pick this up again next time. I know it doesn't feel like we covered a ton. We always have too much fun goofing around in between. The game did just come out today, so you guys can go pick up a copy. I'll have a link to that down below. Thank you to the devs for sending us a key. And we will see you again soon.